look what I got in the mail today. Well, it wasn't today, but it was recently. I just haven't got around to it. As you know, I had some problems with the DT, so I, uh, I've been dealing with that, but it's up and running now. This is my new Voss Dual Sport helmet. And uh, before we get into the unboxing of that, I wanna show you my old Dual Sport helmet, which you've probably seen in some videos. This is my old Voss I believe it was a Dually 600 and I bought it secondhand. I bought it the price is right and there's a lot of really good reviews on this helmet and I took a chance on it and it, uh, it's been an awesome helmet so I really like it. Problem is my son really likes it too so he started wearing it and I've kind of lost ownership of it so I had to purchase a new one. So this video is not sponsored by Voss helmets by any ways. I actually paid for this helmet but I will give you guys a, uh, a, an affiliate link. If you purchase it, it will help out the channel. If you purchase it through the affiliate link, I'll also give you guys a coupon code at the end of this video to save 10% off your purchase of a Voss helmet. And they have everything from dual sport, dirt bike MX to uh, street bike helmets and roadster helmets. Uh, this, is, uh, this has been a great helmet. We'll go through some of the features uh, in a second. But let's just get right into this. Now, I haven't seen this helmet yet. I, I've seen it online, um, of course, because I picked out the color. But uh, I haven't seen it in real life. And I also got myself another chrome visor. So they have a ton of different visor colors you can get. Iridium to orange, red, fire, you name it. And uh, it's, uh, it'll match any bike in any situation you want. So a little packing slip here, and then we'll pull out the good stuff right here. So this is the box here. So I got the uh, size large, so my old one is an extra large and it was just a little too loose on my head. But this is the 601 D2 Dual Sport. It's pin lock uh, visor, so in the winter time, if I want to add a second shield to ride in the cooler months or even wear it as a snow helmet, I can. It includes the pin lock, so a lot of more expensive helmets don't include that so this is this is a really good deal that's the thing the price point on the boss is it blows me away you know actually it feels a little bit lighter than my old one even in the bag but this is the uh the pin lock ready chrome shield so we'll put that on in another video um this is the uh oh it actually has the pin lock lens it actually has the fog lens with it that's awesome. I like it. So we can test that out. Nice little bag. I think pretty much any, any helmet includes a bag nowadays, but uh, let's have a look at this bad boy. I think the, col the color is gonna look slick. Drum roll, please. Oh yeah. Look at that. It's awesome. I don't know whether you can see that, but it's got, I believe it was called oil slick and it actually looks good. Looks way better than what it does in the pictures. So um, yeah, it's fairly light. I mean, the, the helmet itself is only 1600 grams. So for a dual sport MX helmet, it's quite light. Got a really nice shell. I like this matte finish. I, I got it black. I really do like the white on my old one, but I got it black. I was thinking of putting a, a wrap on this, but I might leave it alone actually after seeing this. I think it looks really good. It'll match my 509 gear as well. A couple of things I like about this, it's got dual vents on the, on the top and they have a really nice, easy to reach and easy to activate switch. And then there's a huge exhaust vent at the back, which lets the air blow through. So you uh, you really don't get, get overly overheated in this thing. The lens is pretty optically clear. I mean, this has got the little cover on it. Like that. And then the other thing I like about the Voss helmet is that it has the visor, just like my snowmobile helmets, uh, integrated in and it's an easy switch it's right on the side here I can do it with one finger so when it's on your head it's even easier it's a nice feature you don't have to uh, 
worry about, especially with me wearing glasses while I ride, and glasses do fit underneath this helmet quite well. I use, uh, I wear glasses in my white one all the time. With the chrome lens, it's tinted to begin with, so I probably won't use the visor too much, but uh, this is something new. It's got a little wind guard, um, wind guard right on the nose here. That'll help in the cooler temps, but also help when I'm vlogging to keep the wind off the microphones. And the peak is easy to remove. It's just two screws here, and then you can remove that peak, and it's just, it'll become a street bike helmet for you. Um, three screws. There's one in the top and uh, one in each side. It's DOT approved. That's the FVSS218 certified. And then not only that, it's ECE22.05 certified. Uh, overall, I love this helmet. The other thing I like about the Voss helmet, I noticed it right away when I started riding the white one, is the, uh, the, the vents under the air scoop. In any other helmet I rode like this, like an MX or some of the, the earlier dual sport, I'll call them helmets that I tried out, the, the vent would catch so much air at highway speed, your neck would hurt after a while because it's just, especially a passing truck, it would just jerk your head back. But you can see how open this is right there. And uh, it just cuts the air like you wouldn't believe, but also you tip your head down a bit and uh, you can actually block the sun out. It's pretty amazing. I really like the visor on this. That's that's really the reason that, that I bought another Voss helmet over anything else, is the fit and comfort on the highway is superb. You know, and again, it's a, it's a very light helmet. Oh yeah, this is another thing to point out is this connector here. Easy, you just pull the strap and the buckle will just come right out. So you can hear it ratchet in. It is one-handed uh, release to uh, to get the buckle to release, so it's really really easy. So let's pop this bad boy on. Oh yeah, this one fits really good. And you can see here, I can pop on some glasses if I need to. But yeah, it fits good. And like I said, that release, just like that, and I'm out. I really like it. It's got a nice liner in there. We'll have a look at that liner up close. All right, one of the things I noticed right away, I was just putting my action camera mount on the side of the helmet. They've really upped the game with the, uh, with the interior of this thing. Look how beautiful that is. The other thing is this padding. I love the stitching. It's very, it's like a, the seats in an exotic sports car. But also, too, if you look at this, they actually put a little rubber seal around the outside of the the, uh, the fabric. And I love that because not only is that a wind stop, but it can also stop moisture, dirt, everything else from getting up in there. And it just makes it such a clean fit and finish. It has this little wind stopper as well. I think they've really done a nice job of the quality of manufacturing on this helmet. What else can I say about it? I love the graphics. I love the weight. I love that there's pins on the uh, on the visor so we can add this included anti-fog lens, which is pretty awesome. It looks like you can get light smoke, dark smoke, a yellow. This is a clear one that'll actually snap on. I'll show you how to do that on another video. And then we'll also install the chrome lens in another video. And like I said, it's a, it has a smoke tint on it. And it's going to look spectacular on the Voss 601 D2 Dual Sport Helmet. If you want to get your hands on one of these, scan the QR code that you've been seeing throughout the video. Or visit the link on the screen right now. And there's also a, if you use the coupon code MUDBRATS, at the checkout, you'll get another 10% off your purchase. So. Don't hesitate, get in there today. I don't know how long we'll keep those uh, specials up, but uh, let's get this thing on the bike and see how it performs. Let's take this Voss DT helmet for a rip, shall we?
nothing like the smell of a new helmet on your head. Love it. So like I was saying in the, uh, the unboxing video part, I've had my old Voss 600 Dually for three seasons now and uh, have had no issues with it. I love it. It's just, uh, I even like this large the way it fits a lot better on my head. That's one thing I always was concerned about. And like I said, the visor. So we're now doing about 80 kilometers an hour. And uh, there's no wind resistance on this helmet whatsoever. It's nice. I can take it up to uh, 100, which is 60 miles an hour right now. And uh, same deal. It's uh, no wind resistance. Even when you turn your head sideways, there's, uh, there's very little wind resistance. Uh, I've got the sun visor down right now, and it's... Uh, and my glasses on, so very comfortable. Here we are at 90k. I don't know how you can hear how quiet this helmet is. I mean, I've got the vents open. It's a hot day. We've been seeing record temperatures, 40 degrees Celsius the last few days. But there's not much more I can say about the helmet. Overall, it's a great helmet. Looks amazing. The price is right. And customer service is really good. I had some questions before I ordered and they got back to me right away and away we go. So, and I've ridden this helmet off-road, on-road, put it through its paces and, uh, and I'm very impressed. It fits nice. The look is really good. Uh, the ventilation keeps your head cool on, on hot days like this. What more can I say about the helmet? I really like it. And if you want to get your hands on a Voss helmet like this, visit the link on screen right now and uh, use the Mudbrats coupon code at the checkout for additional 10% off your purchase. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and I'll see you out on the trail.